also a question I had about vitamin C because it is one of the most common supplements that people take, even people that normally don't take others. So you're saying that not only are they obviously wasting money because they're not getting the good effects, but in many cases it's actually doing them harm. As my friend, Dr. Arthur Robinson, alerted me to in 1976, this is a man that did all of Linus Pauling's research. This is not a lightweight. This is a heavy, 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 heavyweight nutritional scientist. He stated to me, 1976, when we put healthy people on high doses of vitamin C long term, they manifested cancer. Now, how clear can we be on this? And today, the so-called holistic alternative doctors with bogus research that is being generated out of the chemical industry, which happens to be the pharmaceutical industry, are telling you if you want to get rid of vitamin, if you want to get rid of cancer, take large doses of chemical vitamin C. And then in the, uh, in the book, you also had an interesting story about the porta potty business. I guess those were all synthetic vitamins that were just going right through people's bodies, not even well, being processed. Absolutely. There's many vegans listening to us today that think they're taking, you know, great supplements because they want to supplement uh, their diet. And they should, but with the right supplements. And how many vegans out there know that, that bonding agents and the shellac that is quite often used on keeping the supplement together, and these are the ones, in fact, they find at the bottom of the porter potties, are made out of the wings of beetles. And there are farms, you vegans listen, there are farms in India that specifically grow these beetles, take their wings, and use them as shellac. Wow. So, I mean, now you ask me why I wrote this book. I mean, supplements exposed should be in everyone's hand in the world today, and we need to change this whole industry to be helpful rather than harmful. Mm -hmm.